इस जगह गई चाहते अब मेरी छीन लूंगा तुम्हें सारी दुनिया से ही तेरे इश्क पे हाँ हक मेरा ही तो है कह दिया है ये मैंने मेरे रब से भी जिस रास्ते तू ना मिले उस पे न हो मेरे कदम तेरे बिन अब न लेंगे एक भी दम तुझे कितना चाहने लगे हम तेरे साथ हो जाएंगे खत्म तुझे कितना चाहने लगे हम यू नो देर आर सम सॉन्ग्स दैट लीव यू एब्सोल्यूटली स्पीचलेस एंड सम ऑफ द सॉन्ग्स कंपोज बाय मिथुन आर लाइक दैट सो आई बीन अ ह्यूज मिथुन फैन एवर सिंस ही स्टार्टेड डूइंग हिज ओरिजिनल म्यूजिक व्हाई एम आई सेइंग ओरिजिनल म्यूजिक because if you remember he started off with some re- remakes of hit songs pakistani songs like bolam hai and adat but i believe his first big break in terms of original composition was when he was asked to compose the title track for bas ek pal because uh, they wanted to do some electro electronic ba- or electro based track which he did and he did it beautifully ever since his journey started as an original composer but many people don't know that he's actually a second generation musician his father mr naresh sharma he was uh, uh, a technical expert at musical arrangements and he used to work with his uncle who is mr pyarelal sharma one half of the popular lakshmikant pyarelal duo so music has always been in his in his family in his blood and he's been growing around musicians and that's probably why he developed uh, uh, such a beautiful skill of writing simple melodies that stick with people so when you listen to mithun's music that's the quality about his music and we'll talk about the song that do you just heard but before that just giving you a bit of a background you know my journey with uh, mithun's music started when i heard the soundtrack of anwar although it's not a very popular film and it's one of the most underrated albums according to me but two of the songs from that album one is mola mere mola which is very popular everybody likes it but one other song which is tose nena lage such a beautiful song so well sung and um, i i don't know what to say about it i mean it, it gives me goosebumps every time i hear this this music and Ever since then I've been a huge fan of his music and every now and then he comes up with a song that becomes so massy <laughs> the song is so simple in terms of its arrangement and that's the beauty about his music he sticks to simple things you know simple melodies with very basic harmonies in the background and he lets the singer shine i personally feel that arijit singh has got the uh, has 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 earned so much because of mithun the reason i say that is because arijit was already singing he had already sung songs in different films which came out and everybody was already liking his voice but the way mithun let him shine in his songs i think that brought out the best of arijit singh and that that's what made him connect with the audience so much So Mithun is one composer who is highly underrated. I think he is one of the best composers around today. And I wish that he keeps creating such beautiful melodies. Now coming to this song Tujhe kitna chahne lage hum. Again a very simple basic melodic pattern, very basic harmony all the time you know it's just four chords going in the background and very uh, common chord progressions also that he uses. which is you often found in uh, pop music but he experiments a lot with keys so his songs are not always in the same key it's not always c major a minor 
he keeps changing them and that that's what gives it a little more variety so we don't feel like we're listening to something that has been already done by him so those things are amazing about his music and i uh, with kabir singh when the tra- the soundtrack came out i was so happy because for a very long time there was not a lot of original music happening in hindi cinema it was mostly remakes 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 and uh, after a while you start expecting the same thing from everybody but kabir singh was a breath of fresh air and this particular track in the movie was special truly special and it has stayed special so it has stood the test of time because even after 2 years of the movie being out we are still listening to it at least i am doing it i hope you people are also so beautifully written song if you want to see the breakdown of this song there's a video by the man himself um uh, done by mashable todford and where mithun is himself is breaking down the music of the song which is why i don't want to do the music breakdown i'm just trying to analyze it as a listener and as an ardent fan so if you want the music breakdown you can go and watch that video i will link it at the end of this video i would love to connect with all of you through this channel or through my facebook or instagram page the handle is at songs guitar music so you please comment or message and uh, let me know what you feel about the songs or the videos that i'm doing in particular if you can share things about your musical experiences i would love to hear that because that would give me a perspective that i'm not the only one who feels this way and when you have people around you who are like minded you always enjoy so i'm looking forward to that from all of you so if you enjoy these videos if you like the content that i create then please 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 hit the like button subscribe to the channel turn on the notifications and please connect with me through your comments this is dhanesh again from songs guitar music and we'll meet in the next video